I was at Twitter from November 2020 through January of 2022 on the executive team as the security lead. I got into information security or to security in general from a very early age. My wife says I didn't have a choice because uh, in my crib, my father had sanded off circuit boards from the 60s and 70s and Nixie tubes, vacuum tubes, and you know, kind of put them in as a mobile. I have something, you know, uh, which is only recently being better understood called dyscalculia. One of the classic tests is if you are given like a line drawing of a house and then a square and it says draw that house. Most people will draw, you know, the large, most obvious and apparent structure. And that's not how my mind works. I'll go, here are some edge cases and everything. But when I apply, apply that to security, you know, you see the door, everybody sees the door and you've put most of the defenses there. But for me, everything is equal. And I'll be looking at the electric lines coming in, the telephone lines. I'll be looking at the surroundings. I'll be looking at the foundation that it's built on, the gutters, the windows on the side. Uh, and that's allowed me tremendous success at figuring out where the actual weaknesses are um, because I'm not functionally fixated. It also allows me to better understand how an, an adversary down the road is going to find the weakest spot. These superpowers ended up giving me this breadth of success, and it was enough that it, you know, uh, attracted Jack Dorsey. So now I want to fast forward to the phone call from Dorsey. Can, can you kind of tell me about what happened? I was, uh, um, you know, told that he was interested in, in speaking with me. I was kind of in awe because I'm talking to, you know, the guy who created, you know, let's face it, a platform that is critical worldwide. It influences governments, social change. It is the perception many people have of the world. He was interested in me, you know, perhaps coming over to uh, Twitter, um, but in a uh, relatively not, not non-standard position. But what really struck me um, was uh, that he said that, you know, when he was growing up, he followed my work. Uh, and that he's a fan for a long time, and that actually uh, I was part of the reason why he got into technology. That just blew my mind. The biggest driving goal was to serve the public conversation and to improve the health of the public conversation. Um, I never expected to be at a social media company, but I, there was no way I wasn't going to uh, step up to the plate and take a swing to try and help. And I'm still trying to help.